What's going on everybody? It's LSU Maniac coming back at you for another little break. And today we're going to be taking a look at a subscription box for baseball. And this is the KMG Sports Cards box. And the one we have in front of us today is the Pro Edition. We've done this last month on the channel. And this is actually my third box to open. And I'm going to say this is another very, very nice sub box, guys. Uh, right off the bat, you notice it's a very good presentation. Uh, it's always nice to have something that's presentable. I, I really respect that. Your black box has arrived. Sports Cards Monthly, just to give you a little look. There they go with their website. I will have that linked in the description. And I've been saying it for quite a while now. I thoroughly enjoy these subscription boxes. And the reason for that is you get to open an assortment of packs. You don't have to go out and spend two, $300 on a hobby box. That's freaking insane. And it's fun. Uh, and this one here delivers in all aspects. It's a very, very good box. If you're looking in the market... For a subscription box that won't break the bank, this is one that I would definitely recommend. There's a bunch of other ones on the market, but I must say this is one of my top ones right here, guys. Here's a nice note. Thank you. We hope you enjoy your purchase. You can read that. Freeze frame it. There goes their website or email at the bottom. Like I said, I will leave all this in the description linked. They got Facebook. Oh, uh, so, like I said, this is the Pro Edition. They're 65 bucks shipped to your door. So, like I said, it's not one that's going to break the bank whatsoever. You get a nice assortment of hobby packs. There is some retail mixed in. And the greatest thing about it, if you don't get in your hits or in your packs, we got some hits inside of here that we will be taking a look at. And uh, let's go through our packs. Now, before we do that, I'm going to step back. Sorry to keep interrupting the break, but... uh. 65 for this they do also offer uh, custom boxes they offer the peewee version which is i think 49 or 45 bucks and they also have a junior version i might have those mixed up i think the peewee is 20 and the junior is 45 so you got a bunch of choices to fit your budget so very very nice how they do that and we got a 2019 update series a lot better than this year's update that was Hobby 2020 Series 1, the best flagship product of the year. That's Hobby. Check this one out. 2018 Heritage High Number Hobby Version. Super nice pack there. We got a Hobby of 2014 Draft. That's an underrated product, guys. It's got a lot of big names in it. 2020 Donruss Optic. One of my favorite, probably my favorite Panini product to open. That's also Hobby. This is a fairly new release, 2020 Heritage Miners. I enjoy that one, Hobby. We have, this is a retail, 2020 Chrome, retail of Gallery, and a retail of Archives. So let's get to digging in here, guys. We got some nice stuff to open. Here we go. We'll start it out with Gallery. Not the hugest fan of Gallery. If you're, It's nothing but art. And if you're into that kind of things, you will enjoy this set. It's not really for me, but it is a nice little rip to rip open. You can find this at Walmart, <laughs> which is a nice thing. The shelves have been dry all year long, and it's just nice to be able to go in and buy something. 2020 Tops Archives. Mr. Juan Gon Gonzalez. There's a Baez. Nice killer brew right there. Boudreau. That's an old Cajun name right there. Lou Boudreau. There's my boy Alex Bregman straight out of LSU, baby. We got an insert of AJ Puck. That's that old Bowman design. Very nice looking card. Josh Hader and Josh Bell. Up next is 2020 Heritage Minor Leagues. And this uh, features them in their minor league uniform. And uh, 
pretty much this and Topps Pro Debut will feature them in their minor league uniform. And I love the names of some of these teams, man. Vidal Bruhan, nice prospect there. There's a nice Alec Baum, and that most likely, no, that's not a short print. D.L. Hall, Heliot Ramos. It's a nice Brennan Davis and a Marco Luciano. Always go back. Heritage always throws some curveballs at you. That's what any set, though, guys. Go Always go back and check out and make sure you don't miss anything because it is easy. 2020 Donruss Optic. See if we can luck up and pull us an auto. Very nice design this year. Thoroughly, thoroughly enjoy Optic. There's a nice Jorge Soler, that iconic Diamond Kings. Very nice. Mr. Bryce Harper, Paul Goldie, and Chris Bryant stained glass. So we're getting kicked on our butt this time. We need to pick it up. 2014 Bowen Draft. This is the place where you can get Raffy Devers, first Bowman, Eloy, Aaron Nola, Matt Chapman. I mean, I could keep going. This is a very good product. There's a Nick Gordon first. We'll take that all day. Foster Griffin Chrome. Lance McCullers and Jeff Brigman first. Brigman. Nice Nick Gordon in there. We'll do this uh, retail of Topps Chrome. 2020 Topps Chrome. Where's some of them big rookies at? No thick ones. Mr. Jonathan VR. There's a Zach Collins. Max Munson. We got a prism of Mr. Chuck Nasty. Nice prism. Love that shine on them prism cards. Very, very nice. Tops Update 2019. Tons and tons of rookies in this class. Vladdy Jr.'s first flagship rookie card. Keston here. The list goes on. Perez. There we go, Mr. Pete Alonzo, rookie debut. We'll take that. Mike Soroka. Getting to our inserts. Greatest players, Mr. Andy Pettit. Joey Gallo, big power hitter right there, left-hander hitter. Gleyber Torres, rookie cup. Lance Lynn and John Means. John Means had a pretty good rookie season, too. And we're down to two packs. We'll do that 18 high number last. 2020 Series 1 hobby. As most of y'all know, getting back into the hobby this year, this product is loaded to the max. There's a nice Bobby Bradley. We'll take him. Didn't play any this year, but should get on track next year. Bobby Bradley is one to keep on your radar. I'm going to tell you that now. Shane Green. We got a gold of David Bodie. We'll take that. Should be out of 2020. 1722 of 220. Nice David Bodie from my second favorite team, the Chicago Cubs. Rojas, rookie, and Tommy LaStella. So we have not got much at all on this break, and that's how it is, though. You can't. But you know what? We got one pack to go, and all it takes is one card, guys and gals. All it takes is one card, and we just did it. <laughs> there we go. Mr. Ronald Acuna Jr. And just like that, the break turns in from being bad to good. Very nice, and it's centered very well, too. That is what I'm talking about. Luke Roy, Preston Tucker. We're going to have an insert in this pack, Mr. Reggie Jackson. Beatty. Martinez and Escobar. But I tell you what, I will take that Ronald Acuna all day, every day. Yes, indeed. Last plaque magic right there, guys. And we got some hits down in here. That's one thing about this. You always can count on some hits. 
They say you're guaranteed three relics or autos in every box. And we got a few little uh, cards here in a team bag. Mr. Forrest Whitley. There's a beautiful Jordan Alvarez, and I do not have this card, and that's National Baseball Card Day stamped. That is fantastic right there. That is the photo, I believe, that is in 2020 update for his rookie debut. And it does say update series on there. But if you notice, there's no rookie debut on it. Very nice card right there. Framber Valdez for my Astros and Fredis Nova. Nice uh, shortstop there. And our first hit. It's going to be Mr. Alex Bregman. Check that out. Nice coin card. 2020 Tops update. I got a couple of blasters we're going to be breaking on the channel. So that's actually my first look at these coins. And I must say they did a lot better job on the uh, update than Series 2. Very nice card. Up next we have an auto. And it is a Brian Abreu. One of our... I tell you what, one of the good pitchers on the Astros rotation that is so, so young. I tell you what, man, the Astros rotation is going to be very, very good for years to come. And our last pack, our last hit of the box is going to be a DJ Stewart rookie from 2019 Chrome. So check that out, guys. Two autos, a relic. We pulled a very nice Ronald Acuna Jr., Couple of decent other cards we pulled. Was not a bad break at all. Could have done better, but I tell you what, guys. KMG Sports Card delivers a very nice box for 65 bucks. You can't beat the price. You've seen the packs that was in it. Well worth the money. I look forward to y'all getting some, seeing y'all's hits that come out of it. Please let me know in the comments what y'all get. And as always, thank y'all so much for the support, guys and gals. If y'all don't mind, please give me a thumbs up, and I will see y'all on the next one. LSU Maniac out of here.